Hey guys, how's it going? Chris Cohen here, and today I'm going to talk to you guys about some cool gear that I'm using in the Filmmaker React episode, as well as in filmmaking in general, that makes my life quite a bit easier. Basically, it's all about transmitting your video signal to any screen wirelessly, without the need for HDMI cables. Now, this is where these little things come in. You have a transmitter and you have a receiver, and this kit is the Holland 400S Mars. Really cool stuff. This is not sponsored, guys. They did send me this a while ago and I've been using it for over a month now. And like I said, I've been using it to duplicate the screens in the Filmmaker React episodes, which has been dope, as well as for filmmaking. Now, it comes to in this box, you have the receiver, you have the transmitter, you have the cool antennas, and you have some other cool things. I will have the links in the description for you guys to get all the data that you need if you're interested. And I was really surprised when I opened it up because these things are built grade A. It is built out of aluminum or aluminium, depending on where you guys are. And it's really sturdy and it's really awesome. And you just touch it and you're like, damn, this is quality. So really impressed by that. And the usability has been so easy. I just fired those things up. And, you know, as many of us, I didn't really care for the info packet. Um, so I just fired them up and within a few seconds, the two are linked and you just hook one of those up to your video source and the other one to your screen that you want to replicate the video to. Like I said, let's take the example in the Filmmaker React episodes. I need I have this screen here for you guys to be able to interact with it and see what I'm reacting to, but I have to have a second monitor across the room where I see it and I react to it. So what I do is I take the transmitter and I hook it up to a second HDMI port of my PC and the PC recognizes it as a screen. And then I take the receiver and I hook it up behind this monitor here and that way the signal transmit to this screen. So I don't have to worry about HDMI cables or anything. My computer is there, it, does, it gets the job done and that is all I care for, which is super cool. Now when it comes to filmmaking, I will hook this up to either the monitor hooked up to the camera or straight to the camera and then I will have the receiver to any monitor that I want. You can actually use regular TVs or monitors as camera displays, which been, is, has been sick. So if you're in a studio environment, you don't have to use the tiny monitors or like use actual filmmaking monitors, like for independent filmmaking. So let's say I'm a photographer in the studio shooting a couple of photos. I ha can have this thing in transmitting to a big monitor so I can see the photos in full size. So really impressed with the functionality. Now the cool trick that this particular system has is that that you don't actually need the receiver. You can actually just use the transmitter hooked up to your video source and then you can use the Holy Land app and basically have up to four devices I think and basically the transmitter is going to share the signal to your phone or tablet and that way the director can have his tablet, the cameraman can have another tablet or his phone as a basically video monitor system and that is really sick because let's say you're gonna use a gimbal right you have your camera set up and you have the gimbal you can super easy hook this bad boy up here and then transmit the signal wirelessly then that's all you need basically now in terms of range I don't remember the exact factor but I wanted to try something really fun. Now, again, we have a lockdown, so it was really hard for me to actually go out there. Um, but I really wanted to test the range. So what, so what I did is I took the transmitter, hooked it up to the PC, and then I played a YouTube video. And then I used the monitor that I have for the camera as my display. And I just went outside the house, round the block, into my car, and the thing was awesome. I had no problems. Like I said, usability, grade A. Build quality, grade A and uh, range again super good i have no problems with it now there are a couple of modes that you can hook them up it takes both hdmi and sdi signal and it's just awesome battery life i haven't killed this yet but i'm guessing it's pretty good as well and that has been it guys uh really fun to use these things and they've been a blast to use in the studio the last couple of weeks because it's really tough to actually go out there currently and get work done. 
but I've been really happy using this in the Filmmaker Reacts episodes. So that is it guys, I will have the links in the description, ask me any questions if you guys uh, have one, and that is it. Let me know if you kind of enjoy kind of like gear showcases as well, because I would like to do some of those, because they're pretty fun to make as well. So that is it guys, until next time, stay awesome and creative. Yeah.